Hello everyone, and today we are looking at Herman again, and we're looking at his expertise skill. And when will it trigger without gear, without a horn, with a normal battle? Well, it triggered in turn 67, and or was it 69? I think 69. And that is quite late. And, well, a side note here is that there is no rage, no extra rage from the horn. Um, and there is no AoE target, so you could have it earlier. So that makes sense, but 69 turns before you trigger your expertise skill. And in a 1v1 scenario, I think that's really bad. But no, that... Uh, Herman is not a 1v1 commander, he is an AoE commander for murder balls and there these stacks of his will like last for 10 plus seconds and if you have a few Hermans running around these stacks will last infinite until a Tomiris comes out and resets them all. But I think where we will see a meta in the field with Herman and we will see a lot of these poison stacks on these commanders in balls inflicted. Um, but yeah, well, there was also a few people discussing that um, the other skills from the other commander would also help to uh, give more poison effect, but that's not the case. Only Herman's skill uh, apply for this, for the poison stacks. So in the next screenshots I have the turns in a two minute battle between me and Pete uh, where Herman was the primary and you see turn 108 and turn 69 where the, sk the turns where it was activated, the, the expertise skill and that's like once every 50 turns on average. And I also want to talk about another thing I find really weird and that is that Juge has actually two active skills. Here you have one active skill and the other active skill. And that seems weird to me until I found out why it was. My theory is because it is an AOE passive skill. Because it's AOE, it is seen as an active skill. And I think it's really weird. Maybe there is buffs, extra buffs that we can get with this. Uh, this damage is not affected by skill damage, that's what the skill description says, but it is another active skill, which is really weird. And the second skill of Juge also has a damage, damage factor, but like it's only a single target, and that's seen as a passive skill. And here it says a passive skill, but in the battle report it said active skill. So I'm quite curious, maybe can someone explain in the comments why this is the case? Uh, anyways... I hope you learned something from that Herman, that it's like triggered his expertise skill in a 1v1 scenario once every 50 turns. And I think with Tomiris in, uh, well, in the open field, it will trigger like once every two skill cycles. And then it's much, much better. And I also figure that with this active extra skill, you might want Juge as primary because then it doesn't mess up the rage bar as much as when it does when Herman is primary. So that might be something interesting as well. But the report still said for me Herman prime uh, as the primary was better. But well it may be just because there is always a difference in each report because of percentage chance buffs. Mm -hmm. So it will need some extra testing over time. And I'm also curious to see Azure Banipal. I will expertise it, but not at reset. I will exp expertise it in like a few months. So it's more free-to-play friendly because I'm free-to-play. And now people ask me, do I recommend Herman? Well, yes and no. If you have only Juge YSG, yes, you really want Herman. Because Herman is gonna give you so much better value. And I have a screenshot that explains this. And here we see Herman Juge versus Juge YSG. And you see that Juge YSG is getting obliterated. So yeah, Herman would be a very solid choice. 
uh, to replace YSG. So if you have this one only March, Juge YSG, yeah. Then I would definitely replace YSG with Herman. And if you're gonna run two marches, you are gonna run uh, Juge with Herman and Bodica with YSG. Your target will take some insane skill damage taken. And well, it's a good debuffing pair in this way. You have two great pairs that will do a lot of damage in the field. So that that's gonna be your march then. Maybe Nebu or some other Archer Commanders are better. I, do, I don't know that much from Archer Commanders. Um, but I'm just talking about um, Juge, Herman, Boudicca and YSG and how you can switch these four around. Well, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you like and subscribe. Join our Discord page in the comments and see you in the next one.